Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, hello. You are spiritually connected with Katiba. That's for sure. Okay, look. He's giving rich auntie. He's giving rich uncle vibes, okay? <laughs> I'm just here to say it. Like, it's giving rich auntie. It's giving rich uncle vibes. And you ain't even rich yet. You're not even rich yet. And we just talking about the financial rich, okay? Because you're already rich in your mind. You're already moving as if you're rich. And this is why people are looking at you like you're rich. This is why people calling you for the money. And you're like, well, damn. You, like, you got people out here asking you for stuff. And they might make more money than you. They might physically have more than you. But it's giving rich auntie and uncle vibes. Because it's the way that you carry yourself. You carry yourself as if you are already rich. But like I said, you're already rich in the mind. You already have the rich mindset. So you know that it's destined for you. You already know where you're headed. You just ain't there yet. People think you're already there. Oh, when they see when you really get there, when you really get there, they're going to know. They're going to know because it's really going to show. Like, you're not all um, crazy about materialistic things, but you like nice stuff. So when when stuff start, when you get to building stuff, when stuff start looking sweet, oh, they're going to know. But right now, they already think you rich. <laughs> you that fun auntie, you that fun uncle. You always the one putting stuff together. You always the one doing something. You always, like, you that one who be just living your life. You be out here living your best life. But the funny thing is, you ain't rich yet. You just... You pretty decent with managing your money like you pretty decent it's like i said it's people out here making more than you and they can't do half of the stuff that you're doing because they have poor money management skills it's people out here making good money at their good jobs and they can't do half of the stuff that you do because they don't have the mental capacity they don't have the mindset to be able to put themselves in a predicament to do what it is that you do you're always making a way you're always good you're always taken care of you always find a way to do what it is that you want to do whenever if ever there's a time that you have to budget or you don't have it it's like you got it and god make a way for you <laughs> that's the funny thing like you that is it, really giving rich auntie vibes okay it's really giving rich uncle vibes this is why people cling on you to you and they attach to you and they want to know like what it is that you're doing or how it is that you're doing what you're doing and it's like when you tell them that they can do it too they don't believe it for themselves because they like shoot i'm already struggling as is i'm already you know in the bond as is i'm already behind as is but you you like i don't care about none of that I'm going to move forward. I'm going to prevail. I'm going to make a way regardless. You're always making a way regardless. It's giving rich auntie, rich uncle vibes. It's the way that you carry yourself. You're very polished, okay? You're not going to show up to a, a function looking raggedy. You're not going to show up um, anywhere just like looking a whole hot mess. <laughs> Unless you're going somewhere that you know that you can be comfortable you're going to show up looking good. You're going to show up polished. You're going to show up smelling good. You're going to show up which, uh, smell, smelling like some shea butter, uh, you know, some perfume. Like, you're going to have your hair done. You're going to have your hair cut. Like, you're going to be polished about yourself. You're going to look good. This is how you move. This is how you operate. And this is why people, they looking at you like, well, who is that? Who is he? Who is she? Because you always just like looking top notch you always looking like you somebody okay because you are somebody you somebody to you you don't really care about what the outside world you know how they looking at you like oh who is that but you like no you want to get up every day it's that self-love okay you want to get up every day and you want to go and um you understand that when you look good you feel good it's giving rich auntie uncle vibes because you do your best to look good <laughs> but you're looking good for you you're looking good for you who else think whoever else think that you look good that's a bonus that's a plus you're constantly getting um compliments about something like people are constantly complimenting you because you just giving off that vibe like hey rich auntie here <laughs> acknowledge me but that's on a subconscious level like you don't really care about that stuff it's giving rich auntie rich uncle vibes because you stand out in the crowd 
because it's only like three, four people in the room that really look good, that really got their stuff together. And you one of them. <laughs> you one of them. It's giving rich auntie, it's giving rich uncle vibes. Because you the one that's going to make something happen. You the one that's going to put the place together. You the one that's got that fun thing planned. You know my niece told me, she said, auntie, I want to go to your house. Your house fun. <laughs> and that's all, like, my niece ain't been to my house in years. But that's all she remembers is that. Auntie house is fun. You that rich auntie, that rich uncle that can get them kids and can give them, show them a good time and give them back. <laughs> it's giving rich auntie, it's giving rich uncle vibes because of your mindset. Because of the type of things that you like to focus on, the ways in which you have built yourself up, like where you are today, your age and where you are today, compared to some of your peers that you may have grown up with or been around, you doing it, you doing your thing. Like you're not the average person. Like you have more than the average person on a mental capacity. Like I said, some people, they got it all together. They got the American dream going. But they broke. <laughs> but they living paycheck to paycheck. But they in the hole. But they let their accounts get overdrawn. But you, you subtle, you smooth, you soft life in it. Like you doing whatever it is. Like you just living, living your life. You prioritizing like your peace and your your happiness. You prioritizing, you know, how to build your finances and you learning how to invest and stuff. Like this is only the beginning. That's the funny thing. This is only the beginning. So they looking at you as this rich auntie, this rich uncle, and you really ain't even got it like that yet. Okay. Yes, you didn't. You didn't put your laid your hands on some money. Yes, you got something in the bag. Yes, you got something in the bank. Like I say, even if, when you don't, people still think that you got it. Crazy. Like I didn't have people ask me for stuff when I was down. I'm like, shoot. Really, I would like to ask you for something, but. I'm not that guy. <laughs> I'm going to go figure it out. But, yeah, it's giving rich auntie, uh, rich uncle vibes with you. And um, people, people, they see you. They see you. They like, oh, she doing her thing. So that, oh, he doing his thing. So that can cause some people to, be, like, gravitate towards you. Like, oh, well, what is that you doing? I want to do that too. But then you got some people who really don't like you because of it. They really don't like you because of it because you get too much attention. Because when they tried to copy you, it didn't work. And they didn't get that attention that you got. It's giving rich auntie, rich uncle vibes. And when they tried to do it too, they wasn't giving rich auntie, rich uncle vibes. They was just giving, oh, they doing stuff. Oh, they, <laughs> like, oh, they did that too. <laughs> it's giving a copycat for, for some of them. But mm, that's a whole nother story. That's a whole nother video. You give rich auntie, rich uncle vibes just by the little things you do. Just when people step into your house, it's, it's different. Like you may have a candle lit. Oh, it's different. It's giving rich auntie vibes. You may have certain decor. It's different. You may have people take your shoes, they shoes off in your house. It's different. You may be able to travel. It's different. You may have already started investing. It's different. You are doing the. You may be getting up at 5 a.m. You're different. It's giving rich auntie, rich uncle vibes because that's your destiny. That's where you're headed to. Your actions are already already said that. Like your actions already is showing where you're going. As long as you keep it up, and people see that. So on one hand, they're complaining about you know how you may be showing up or not showing up or the type of things that you're doing but on the other hand they see a progression and that's what's getting you to where you are that's that is what has gotten you to where you are today and they don't understand like this is only the beginning it's gonna be a lot more cutting off it's gonna be a lot more isolation it's gonna be a lot more grinding it's gonna be a lot more focus because you understand what you focus on grows so you focus on the riches <laughs> you focusing on the peace you focusing on the wealth you focusing on the the uh the good mindset you focusing on the healthy relationships and this is what gives you the rich 
the rich auntie and the rich uncle vibes because of your focus and where your focus goes energy flows and it grows and because you focusing on your mission you know that you got stuff to do you know stuff you want to do like you make sacrifices the average person is not sacrificing anything they're not sacrificing anything you make sacrifices to get to where you're to where you're at today like you have made sacrifices and that's what people don't see. They think that you got it easy, but you really don't. Like, you done been through so many struggles, so many hardships to get to where you're at today. Like, you really had to put that work in. You really had to go out there, put your head down, and go to work. Like, you've done that. Nothing came to you easy. <laughs> you wasn't born with a silver spoon in your mouth, and you didn't get much of nothing handed down to you. If anything, it's giving rich auntie rich uncle vibes but you deserve every bit of it because you work very hard to get to where you're at like you've worked for it you worked for it you had to do that nobody couldn't pick you up and make you do it nobody couldn't do that so when you really get there like on a on a on a financial level to where you want to be people are really going to be knocking at your door but I promise you, I hear these stories. It's going to be them same people who was doubting you. It's going to be them same people who um, who didn't understand what you was doing. So they talked messed about you for the decisions that you made. Not understanding that it was a sacrifice to get to where you're, um, where you're going to be at. Like, it's going to be them same people that's going to be in your ear and they're going to be in your pocket. But they went with you shooting in the gym and they didn't even agree with you shooting in the gym. They'd rather you just be shooting in the backyard. That's what they rather. So, I'm going to just say that. Like, you ain't rich yet, but you damn show near. You damn show on your way. You damn show putting yourself in alignment with it. So, whatever you doing, keep doing it. But turn it up a notch. Turn it up a notch. Cause we like, like, ugh, it's destined, okay? It's destined. It's a, only a matter of time. You can get it soon or you can get it later, but it's coming for you regardless. As long as you keep doing what you're doing and the, uh, letting all that outside noise, people's opinions and stuff like that, go, okay? Letting them go. So if this video resonates, if it hit different, let me know how so. If you are new here, I do invite you to hit the subscribe button. Members, gang, gang, I see y'all is up. Look, that's all I have for this video. Stay spiritually you, stay spiritually in tune, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.